Howdy folks, Larry Leroy Lawrence the last coming to you from the farm. Got a little something I want to talk to you about today. Uh, down there at the, uh, at the church where I go, we got us a new pastor. And uh, boy's doing a fine job. I just want to share it with everybody. He came, I don't know, maybe a year or so ago, he came and he did a, did a little sermon for us so we could decide if we wanted him or not. And, and I remember just plain as day, it's almost like it was yesterday. I heard him say when he got through with that sermon, he said, if you make me your pastor, I will make your church great again. And I thought, boy, wouldn't that be nice, have our church great again. Uh, but, but anyway, we, we voted him in and he come on. And I just want to give you an update. Boy, I tell you right now, our baptisms are up, our rededications are up, our attendance is up, our... Our tithing is up, all the money's up. I mean, we got money coming out to Wawa, but, uh, you know, our absentees are down. You know, all the bad stuff's down, the good stuff's up. Uh, we, we even got some new tires on the church bus. I mean, that thing, they've got it tuned up and all. We, it, ain't, it ain't run so good, and I don't know how long. And then uh, he went out in the community, and he talked to some of the, the business owners, and we had a few people in the church that uh, didn't have jobs. He got them jobs. I mean... Uh, I guess if you want to look at unemployment, unemployment in the church as low as it's ever been. Uh, but uh, he he done some he done some good stuff. He uh he he had to he got rid of some of the old deacons and, and uh, he got some new ones in there and and uh, they had some business sense about them and they started doing things and uh, he called it draining the swamp. You know uh, I don't know what you, what you really ought to call it, but but uh, it seemed to work and uh and uh, <clears throat> man look I got to tell you. I might not ought to say this, but that preacher's wife, woo, big tall man, she, woo, probably the prettiest preacher wife, without a doubt, prettiest preacher wife we ever had. And uh, she speaks five or six different languages. I ain't talking about speaking in tongues neither, because we don't do that, but she, she can really speak five or six different languages. Now, there was a lady about two or three weeks ago we thought was speaking in tongues, but it turned out she's just speaking Spanish, that's all she knew. Uh, she, she don't know how to speak English, but we're working with that. You know, if you're gonna go to our church, you gotta learn how to speak English. So we we working with her, trying to trying to teach her some uh, some English. Uh, but anyway, I just want to let everybody know that uh, the church is doing good. What I gotta say this though, about half the congregation they don't like him. You know, they say he's in collusion with them Branch Davidians over yonder in in Texas. Well, what few of them left? You know, they had a little fire a few years ago, but. But anyway, I don't believe it's any truth to that collusion. You know, they said something about a dossier or something. They got. It turns out it was one of them branch Davidians wrote that. So I don't, I don't, I don't believe any of it. But uh, uh, anyway, I hope he stays around for a long time and keeps things going like this because he has sure made our church great again. And I wanted to go on record and tell the public I appreciate him and I hope he stays with us for a long time, a long time. But anyway. Uh, Larry Leroy Lawrence, the last, coming to you from the farm, and I'm just going to sign off now and say, uh, until next time, see ya.